In Creo 10, the roughing high speed milling sequences can use a mill volume as a reference for machining. Let's review this manufacturing model. In HSM rough, we can either select a mill window that will machine the two pockets in the top, in this example, or if we select the mill volume, we are defining exactly the target material to be removed in this toolpath. In this case, the second pocket is ignored. Even when we switch to 3 plus 2, as the mill volume is limited just in the top, there is no additional toolpath. Let's use now another mill volume that this time includes more pockets to be machined. We select the mill volume in the reference collector, select three axes in the first calculation, and then we can switch to three plus two just to show how easy it is to do complex roughing sequences with this toolpath. We can notice when the mill volume allows it, the tool can enter from the side. And when it's not possible, it's calculating an helical entry into the material. This easy to use functionality gives you more flexibility, reduces programming time, and provides more control on defining the machining area in 3 plus 2 rough and rest rough NC sequences.